What is going on YouTube? Up and I'm here and today we have another Madden 22 video. Today I'm excited to share with you my top 10 team diamonds in the game and then we'll talk a little bit about the master. So this video took me a little while to get prepped and made sure looking at stats and all that. So please make sure you hit that like button, hit that sub button, turn those noti bells on, especially if this is helpful for you. Okay, let's jump into my top 10 team diamonds that are going to be coming into the game. Before we get into the team diamonds, let's look at the team diamond master. It's going to be this 95 Dan Marino. You're going to need to collect all 32 team diamonds collectibles in order to build this Dan Marino or you can buy them on the auction house. So here it is. This is a first QB in Madden 22 with Hot Route Master. Okay, I don't believe he's gonna get um, Gunslinger as well because I think he's, I think it's the threshold is a 95 throw power on a field general quarterback. That's how it was in the past. Could be different, but I do not believe he gets um, Gunslinger and Hot Route Master. But he will get set feet lead. Okay, so that's gonna be really solid. So set feet lead and Hot Route Master. That's a pretty good W to me, in my opinion. Speed's a little bit low, but do we have had better masters? Maybe, but this is still a really, really solid card, especially this early in Madden. All right, now let's get into the top 10. All right, first on my list here, we have this Deuce uh, Staley. I think that's how you say it. All right, he's a running back on the Eagles. He also, play, he also played for the, I believe the Steelers. Okay, so you can definitely have him on your, your Steelers theme team or your, your uh, Eagles theme team. But look, that 91 speed, 92 change of direction, and he's a receiving back. This card is going to be really, really nice. Like I said, um, the 91 speed plus being a receiving back, his, his catching is probably going to be really solid. So or so, His catching is at 79, powered up will be an 80. Will be a really, really good running back in the game. Next on my list is going to be this Jack Tatum. The reason why this card's on the list, like really high up on this one, is because he is a Raider. Raider's theme team just got a huge boost. He also is a, you can, I think he, he'll be a Titan. You could be on the Titans theme team as well. So another big boost for the Titan uh, theme teams. 89 speed, powered up will be a 90. All right, you'll have your chems, you have your Raiders chems if you have a theme team. This is going to be a really, really solid, um, strong safety, a great user. His hit power is a 91. Yeah. This card is really, really solid, especially for those theme team enthusiasts out there. Okay, then we have this uh, Charlie Joyner, wide receiver on the Chargers. He also gets Tennessee, uh, t the Titans camps, and I want to say Cincinnati, I believe. All right, 91 speed. All right, 89 jumping. His route running is really, really solid as well. This is going to be a really nice card to use, especially for... Um, for that, those Chargers theme teams, or like I said, <laughs> the Titans have a really solid theme team right there as well. So 91 speed is a really quick receiver, especially right now in the game. So he's gonna make my list for sure. The next card we have this Charles Haley, all right? Goes on the uh, Niners and Cowboys, I wanna say. All right, 86 speed, he's got some really solid finesse moves. I do wanna give a special shout out to my guy Colt45, who is running the virtual lab partner all right this card is going to be huge in his next game plan that he's putting out so make sure if you are interested go and check out virtual lab partner on twitter all right get the latest uh um game plan from colt he's a honestly super smart he's he, he's very knowledgeable on uh madden and all these abilities and stats and these thresholds that you need so definitely gonna be a really really solid ad so yeah, go ahead and check out Virtual Lab Partner on Twitter. All right, we have um, Talib right here. Really, really nice card. 90 speed. Okay, so that's really good. He's got uh, 90 man, 87 zone. So he plays for the Rams, New England, and the and the Broncos, I believe. I think he played for. I could be wrong. I'll show you the whole list of all of them later, thanks to Metality. But I'll get that to, to that at the end. But yeah. This card might be one of the better corners in um, for this program right here. This Team Diamond uh, Akib Talib. All right, I really I think this card is gonna be really solid. I think he's six one as well. His ninety one jumping is gonna be really good. Put acrobat on him. 
probably be a really good uh, corner in the game. Andre Ryson is another uh, wide receiver that we're getting in the game. 90 overall speed. He's going to be made my top 10 list. He plays for a lot of different theme teams. I can't, I can't remember them all off the top of my head, but I have the list, so I'll show you shortly. But yeah, uh, short route running, deep route running, and uh, mid route running is all pretty solid. Um, again, another really good receiver. A lot of good receivers out of this Team Diamond program, considering um, all the other cards. Next, we have Aaron Glenn, 91 speed, so really, really quick. Good for the Jets theme team right here. The only issue I have with this card is that he is pretty short. I believe he's under six foot tall. I want to say I could be wrong on that, but I believe he's under six feet. So that'll make it a little bit mm, meh. But other than that, the speed's really, really solid. His man and zone stats are not bad at all. And presses at 87. So not, not too bad of a card. Bills legend Thurman Thomas, as my guy Retro Yimmy would say. All right is back in Madden 20, uh, sorry, back in the Madden game. 90 speed, 91 change of direction, which is really, really solid. His catching is at an 82. He's a receiving back as well. All right, backfield master most likely on him. Um, and his, his, uh, his acceleration is really solid. Break tackles at 92. So honestly, a really solid uh, running back in this program. Next up, we have Bernard Pollard. Speed's a little bit low, but he is a... Um, a strong safety, 88 speed, his hit power is really, really solid. If you want to put him in the box, it could be a decent user. All right, his zone is not bad either, but the man coverage is a bit low on that card. So again, it'll take, it'll make my top 10 list, but it's still not, not very high on that list, I want to say. And last but not least, we have this Larry Wilson, free safety, 89 speed, will be a 90 speed powered up. If you have different camps on him and your strategy card, it should be a decent speed. Boost. His, his hit power is a little bit low, but man and zone are not bad. All right, his pursuit is good. So and those are that's gonna be the top ten team diamond in my opinion. Obviously, that's my opinion, and um, obviously, if you have a different idea, that's fine as well. But these are the the ones that stand out to me. All right, and if you need, we have the the whole list right here of every team cam that each card has on it so you can see here all of them will show all the team camps whether they actually get all these is one thing but this is all from like i think pro football reference so uh shout out to guy, my guy muttality who just got partnered which is amazing who put this list together for us and um again i'm not sure if it's exactly accurate yet but we'll find out um uh when when these cards are actually in game okay so there you have it Everything you need to know about Team Diamonds and my top 10 list right there. I'll catch you with another video very soon. Hit that like button, hit that sub button, turn those noti bells on for more Man 22 content.